freehold, leasehold, free zone. These are, okay, from now on we'll be talking about some terminologies that you have to know. Freehold means absolute ownership of a property, 100% ownership, and it could be freehold for all nationalities, freehold for GCC nationals, or freehold for UAE nationals only. For example, in Jumeirah and in Al Wasl, most of the properties are freehold for GCC nationals. Green community is free. Exactly, leasehold 99 years. Dubai Silicon Oasis is exactly leasehold for 99 years. Green community, Dubai Silicon Oasis are leasehold. So in Dubai Silicon Oasis, they have started some specific yeah. buildings, converting them to freehold. Data is? Which one? Data. data. Most of data. Emirati, GCC. Freehold, Emirati. Freehold, GCC. Okay, a tricky one. Commercial plots on the first line of Sheikh Zayed Road are? One-time registration. Eh? One-time registration means first owner only. First, first owner freehold. And, then and he can lease it ninety. Uh, lease hold it ninety nine. No, if he sells it, he can sell it only to GCC nationals. Okay. Unless there is a special approval, which is not very easy for Sorry. everyone. One-time registration means, as the first owner, you will have freehold ownership. Any nationalities? All nationalities. After the first owner, the second buyer have to. But must be GCC. DIP? Freehold. Lease. Leasehold. So how does the leasehold work, Sheikh? Does it have to be 99 years? No. Can be 35 years. Leasehold can be one year even. Like in Al-Quz. There are many areas in Al-Quz or Al-Quz where you have lease, one year lease. Mariam's warehouse was one year lease. Or leasehold can be 35 years. It can be 30 years. It can be 90 years. Leasehold can be 1 year, 30 years, 15 years, 20 years, 90 years, 99 years. So, in the leasehold, you own the structure, you don't own the land. You are a tenant on the land and the structure belongs to you. This is, you have all the rights on the land, you can modify the property, you can sell your right, you can own it 10 years, 50 years, 99 years for a limited period of time, and even it will be transferred to the inherit its inheritance applies also. If you die, it will go to your sons and your children and your wife. Okay? The and then when the lease expires, even whether it's one year or ten years or ninety-nine years, when the lease expires again you will renew the lease. In many cases, in some cases, Master developers and the landlords of all these huge master developments are saying that by the time the lease expires, we might, maybe, we cannot guarantee now, we might sell the ownership and the priority will be the tenant who was occupying the land for the past 80, 70, 50, 30, 40, whatever, years. The other term is free zone. Freehold and leasehold are the types of ownership and free zone has nothing to do with these. Free zone is a term that tells as are the areas where you can have 100% ownership of the company and for trade your tax is less or is zero, tax free. This is free zone. How many free zones are in the UAE? Uh, many. Wait. Name some of them. DMCC, Jabal Ali Free Zone, Dubai Airport, Ras Al Khaimah Free Zone, Healthcare City. JLT is the name of the area. The name of the free zone is DMCC. 
So free zone is where you can practice your business, knowledge village, healthcare city. Okay. So yeah. So free zone is the area where you can practice your trade and your businesses tax free, and you will have hundred percent ownership of your company. John, we are not talking about free zone company establishments here. I just want you to understand the difference between free zone, freehold, and leasehold. Free zone is an area where there is 100% company ownership. There are many free zones. Every free zone is offering its own features. Some free zones are offering you services related to a specific industry, like healthcare city for the health and medical services, knowledge village for the universities and educational institutes. So this is the term free zone. Freehold and leasehold are about the ownership but of the property. there is property. no residential part or anything in free zones. There are. There are. Why not? Which one? Bhaijan, Baba, Ay Khoda, what's wrong with you guys today? Free zone has nothing to do with the ownership. Jumeirah Lake Towers is a free zone area where all the licenses are the MCC. Okay, can you not own a, own a two-bedroom in, the S, in uh, Goldcrest? My point is, as far as I know and understand, when we talk about free zones, we are talking about companies and licenses and everything. Exactly. Yes, free zone is about companies, licenses and businesses. It has nothing to do with the ownership, with the form of ownership. This way, free zone versus DED. Dubai Economic I Department. I that. Look at it this way. Free zone versus Dubai Economic Department. Freehold versus leasehold. Clear now? Please ask if it's not clear. My point is that we are talking about free zone. This is with Antu Saresh. No, 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 you already gave me a massage today morning. No. My point was that. A person like me, I only know free zone as companies or we are setting up a company or something like that. But I'm not aware of any building or residential part which comes under free zone. I know DMCC, JLT is a part. I'm oh, just... I mean, I mean, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Okay. I'm a little confused in that. I know JLT or these buildings are part of DMCC. Okay. But I was not sure that like, these residential parts come into free zone as well. I'm just a little confused. The that. area is a free zone area. Okay. The whole area of JLT is a free zone. And which authority is there? DMCC. DMCC is the free zone authority in JLT. So all the businesses in JLT must be licensed and registered in DMCC. They don't go under the ED. With the Dubai Economic Department license, you cannot have an office in, in, in JLT. You need to have a DMCC license, which could be your main license or it could be a branch of your DED license. That's a, that's a different thing. What? Another thing. No, no, wait. Is it, uh, do you think it's more confusing? Yes, it's more confusing. Okay? So, free zone versus leasehold. Free zone is about the ownership. Leasehold is about the business. Leasehold is about the business. Okay? So, the whole JLT is a free zone area, which is the authority there is DMCC. So if you want to have a license in JLT, you have to be registered in DMCC. When it's a free zone authorized by DMCC, it means that other areas, other forms of company ownerships cannot have offices, cannot practice business over there. It means if you have a license from uh, British Virginia or from Dubai Economic Department, you cannot have an office there unless and until you register it, you register your business in DMCC. So but this has nothing to do with the ownership. Still, you can own an office as a property or an apartment as a property. Why? Because the form of ownership is freehold for all nationalities. Oh. In uh, Jumeirah Business Center, in Goldcrest, in Valid Paradise, in uh, all the towers in JLT, you can own. The form of ownership, the form of land registration, land ownership is freehold. The form of business is free zone. One question. You shouldn't even think about it. Guys, that's enough for today. Thank you very much.